Welcome to this special multiplayer DVD version of Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Your chance to try your luck in that famous hot seat and compete against your family or friends to be the first to reach the magical million pound mark and the chance, of course, to win a family holiday to Universal Mediterranea. Now, all you need is your DVD remote control. You can move around the screen and make your choices by using the up, down, left, right and enter buttons. It really couldn't be simpler. Right, if you're ready, Let's play. Right, here we go. Let's go over the rules, although I'm sure you're familiar with them all by now. You are 15 correct answers away from winning a virtual million pounds. Now, as always, you can walk away at any time. And if you do get stuck, then you have the usual three lifelines. There's 50-50. You can phone a friend. Or, of course, you can ask the audience. OK, if you're ready, all you need to do now is select the number of players and we can play Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Right, you have 15 questions and three lifelines. The very best of luck. Let's play. OK, for 100 quid, here's question number one. Nice one, it's the correct answer. Have a look at question number two, it's worth 200 quid. Think carefully, there's no time limit. Easy peasy, and that's the right answer. Here's question number three. It's worth £300. Congratulations, that's the right answer. Remember, a wrong answer here and you will leave with nothing. I'm sure that won't happen. Question number four. Do any of the answers stand out at all? No problems there, it's correct. Now, get the next question correct and you'll leave with at least a thousand pounds. Good luck. Here comes question number five. Absolutely spot on. Well done. You've reached the first milestone. That's £1,000. Now, have a look at question six, because it could double your money to 2000 The name of which sauce is derived from the Italian pestare, meaning to crush? Passata, pesto, provençal, or piquant? That's great, it's the right answer. Here comes question number seven out of a possible 15. It's worth 4,000 pounds. Good luck. Cartomancy is the art of predicting the future by reading what? Cards, maps, he leaves, harms. Final answer. You lose a grand if it's wrong. Congratulations, that's the right answer. OK, if you choose the right answer to the next question, you can double your money to £8,000. Let's have a look at question 8 of 15. In which century was the English adventurer Sir Walter Raleigh beheaded? 14th, 15th, 16th? Or 17th. Is that your final answer? You could double your money if you get this one right. Well played, you're absolutely right. 
Right, the jumps are starting to get a lot bigger now. Here is question nine for a possible £16,000. Of which South American country is Bogota the capital? Venezuela, Ecuador, Peru or Colombia? Wonderful, it's the right answer. Okay, this is where the drops start to get steeper. Get the next question wrong and you lose £15,000. But get it right and you win 32000 guaranteed. Complete the title of Louis de Bernier's novel The War of Don Emmanuel's Body Parts, Nether Parts, Hind Parts, Bit Parts. Have you got any inkling at all? Well played, that's correct. Right, question number 11 is worth £64,000. You would still walk away with 32000 even if you got it wrong. But let's hope you don't. Which novel by Raymond Chandler introduces the private eye Philip Marlowe? Farewell, my lovely. The big sleep. The long goodbye. Or the high window. Jolly good, it's the right answer. Right, the next question is worth a whopping £125,000. It's number 12 of a possible 15. Take your time, it's a lot of money. Anglia Polytechnic University has a base in which city? Norwich, Ely, Ipswich or Cambridge? It's up to you. Remember, you don't have to play. OK, you'd like to ask the audience. Audience, have a look at the possible options. Are you ready? OK. All vote now. OK, let's phone a friend. Now, who do you think might be able to help you choose the right answer? Uh, it's between a couple. B looks favourite, but I wouldn't want to bet too much on it. Sorry, I can't be more certain. <laughs> OK, you've decided to use your 50-50. Computer, please take away two random wrong answers, leave the correct answer, and the one remaining wrong answer. Congratulations, that's the right answer. Right, now just take your time and relax. The next question is number 13 of a possible 15. If you answer and you're wrong, you drop back to 32,000 pounds. Here's the question for a quarter of a million. Which American author wrote the book Bright Lights, Big City? Brett Easton Ellis, Douglas Copeland, Jeff Noon, or Jay McInerney? Are you absolutely sure we're talking about a huge amount of money here? Yes, you're absolutely correct. Well played. 
This is now getting very, very serious. You are just two correct answers away from winning one million pounds. But if you give me a wrong answer here, you will lose 218,000 pounds. Not good. Have a look at question number 14, but think very carefully about what you want to do. Who did not play one of the three main doctors in the film Ghostbusters and its sequel? Rick Moranis, Bill Murray, Dan Aykroyd, or Harold Ramis? I just remind you, you do not have to play this. You would drop £218,000 if it's wrong. You didn't have to play that, but I bet you're glad you did. It's correct. Fantastic, you have played a brilliant game so far, and now you have £500,000. But we would really like to give you one million. Take as long as you need. Here comes the million pound question. Who was the first man to be president of all 50 US states? Harry S. Truman, Dwight Eisenhower, John F. Kennedy, or F. D. Roosevelt? Well, you could have walked away with half a million pounds. But instead, you'll be walking away with one million pounds. That's the right answer. Fantastic. What a tremendous game. All 15 questions answered correctly. Well done. You are a virtual millionaire. Congratulations. Now, for a chance of jetting off for a fabulous holiday to Universal Mediterranean, all you have to do is write this special win code on the postcard provided and send it to us in the post. It couldn't be easier. Good. Well done and thank you for playing. Who wants to be a millionaire?